Well, almost four months ago today, Bob Bankin and Doug Hurley became the first astronauts launched from U.S. soil in nine years. Their test flight on board the SpaceX Crew Dragon became a key moment in NASA's commercial crew program. Well, now SpaceX and NASA are ready to send another team up into space. News 6's James Farvero has the latest updates on their plans for Crew 1. I want to thank God for getting us to this point. The second team of Crew Dragon astronauts, pilots Victor Glover and Mike Hopkins, and Shannon Walker and Suichi Noguchi, the first international SpaceX crew member. Every day is a new day in space. Enjoy every moment. Return home with smile. Mm -hmm. In the early morning of Halloween, these four are scheduled to begin a 25-hour flight to the International Space Station, starting at the same launch pad where Bob Behnken and Doug Hurley were the first to pilot a SpaceX capsule. We would like to uh, welcome you aboard Capsule Endeavor. Just like Behnken and Hurley named their dragon, the Crew-1 astronauts also came up with a name for theirs, Resilience. It is really an honor of uh, the SpaceX and, and the NASA teams, and, and quite frankly, it's an honor of our families, of our colleagues, of our fellow citizens, of uh, our international partners and our leaders that have all shown that same quality, that same characteristics uh, through these difficult times. Crew-1 will dock Dragon Resilience to the space station for an expected six months. And so it is huge, the amount of research that we can get done, still work on science while you're doing other things with the space station, be it maintenance or, or other items that need to be taken care of. Until liftoff, NASA says it's working on a small leak discovered on the space station, but that leak is not considered a danger to the space station or to the crew. On the Space Coast, I'm James Sparvero, getting results news 6.